My name is Clement. I'll be going to uh, Stanford for a master's in uh, electrical engineering. First of all, the online application form was uh, actually pretty straightforward because it came after uh, the application on the university and it's pretty much the same thing. The ideas of uh, what you want to do and uh, the, your motivations have become more clear since you have uh, already applied to the university, so it goes pretty smoothly and uh, so that was uh, really cool. And uh, for the interviews, it also went very, very well because uh, you can ask anything you want before, you have enough information about how it will go and uh, since, uh, once again, since everything is clear in your mind and you can come and just show your motivation and things went uh, quite smoothly actually. Yes, it's uh, starting really early and uh, I started in July, I thought that it was uh, enough but if I had started just even one or two months before that would have been really great just to go through the universities and know the programs a little bit better. Uh, I spent some long nights just to know uh, what the programs would be and I think I could have had uh, easier nights before. The main advantage of the, of the US uh, was that universities are bigger and since I wanted to have uh, uh, interdisciplinary uh, courses in my field of interest, which is wireless communications, it was, I didn't find anywhere else that uh, had uh, such uh, an opportunity. That was my main reason for wanting to go to the US. The tests are the same for uh, all the universities. Uh, at least in engineering, you have to take the, the GRE uh, and the TOEFL. Uh, I took them in, in December and uh, yeah, one thing to note about the, the GRE and the TOEFL, just uh, book the test date early like I did them, I, I booked them in September or October I think and it's actually pretty, it can be a little bit late already in, you know, in October so that's uh, good to think about. Uh, so th those are the tests and then we have a personal statement to write. Uh, which is really, really important and not that used to do it in, uh, in Belgium. And about the personal statement, it's important to have it reviewed by uh, someone else. I have it, had it reviewed by five persons and had I done it with more, it would have been actually even better. And every person was important and uh, I think if, uh, if I had sent the first draft, I wouldn't have gotten it anywhere. So just, uh, it's really important to have it uh, proofread by uh, someone else. Uh, it can be anybody, uh, mostly yeah, it's better if someone who has already been to the U.S., either through uh, the application process or just there for, uh, for research or anything who has an idea of the, of the culture of the, 